praise the Lord. Bishop Wooden here with the maestro himself, <laughs> the minister Clarence Page Rayford, better known with the moniker Rocky, the name that his dad gave him, a genius um, songwriter, a tremendous man of God. And we're here to invite you this Sunday night yes, to come to the great Christmas gala. Yes, sir. We're excited. December the 4th, here, the first Sunday night in this month. Yes, sir. Celebrating our Christmas gala. We're going to be singing. We're going to be worshiping the God of the Bible, celebrating the fact that Jesus Christ came to this earth, yes, he did. born of the Virgin Mary, and we acknowledge and recognize and celebrate his birth. And by the way, it is the only, and I mean only, federally yes, recognized holiday Absolutely. in the month of December. Yes. And all this season's greeting yeah. stuff, let me tell you, the federal government only recognizes exactly. Christmas. Christmas. And, at, and at the upper room, uh, we do not have, uh, we don't celebrate the holidays. We don't even call it the holiday season. For us, it's Christmas, Christmas time. It is, it is, it is, <laughs> Bishop, yes sir. To tell them a little bit about this powerful choir, the powerful musician, the things that's wow. gonna go on. Well, Pastor, I can, wow. Let me just say this, we have a great group of singers, yes. uh, very talented, very anointed, love God, save musicians and all, so, uh, just a lot of great musicians, great experiences, uh, musicians. We thank God for the hard work they've been putting in, the choir who serve all the time. Amen. Some of the best singers in the best world. Best singers in, my in the world. Yes, sir. In my opinion. Yes, sir. Best singers, best <laughs> band, band, in the world. best minister of music, <laughs> just the best. Yes, sir. And we serve the God of the Bible. Yes, sir. We're looking so, uh, so forward to Sunday night, our Christmas gala. They have worked really hard and thank God for what he has brought together. Amen. I'm telling you, it's going to be excited. We have a lot of great things planned. The youth choir, the mega youth choir, my God, we rehearsed last night and I'm telling you, Pastor, the young people are on fire for the Lord. It's going to be a phenomenal turnout. The men are going to do a great job. The women, have, I heard them last night. There, what so about what about the mothers? Pastor, we got, now, we got now, a back home hour. I'll tell you something. <laughs> we got something in store. You do not want to miss this you back don't home miss it. hour. We have something. And you talking about a group of women who are fired up and men of God <laughs> who are fired up. I'm telling you, Pastor, they are excited. And you know something? They got something to say. Hallelujah. And, and guess what? They are talented. Yes, sir. Well, yes, sir. Yes. They have great talent. I know that my mama is one of exactly. them. Exactly. And we have exactly. fantastic mothers yes. here. Exactly. And, and, and also, our gala enables us to be a blessing this Absolutely. time of the year for families who are struggling, who are going through. It is a benefit. It is. And so we're able, you know, just think about this. You go to your mailbox. You're not expecting it. No one has told you. Or you get a phone call that there is a blessing for you. Come by the church office or there's a blessing in your mailbox courtesy of the Upper Room Church, church of God, God in Christ yes, Christmas Gala. Yeah. So we want you to come. It's going to be nice. You're going to enjoy yourself. We're looking forward. We're going to tell the whole world that she, that Jesus Christ is born. Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh -huh.